Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 71 of Ocean Block. What? <laughs> um, today we're gonna be going and making some more singularities. Hopefully, we'll get more than one done today. We're gonna for sure do sea pickles because they're ready. Um, and we're gonna try and figure out why the capacitators are not working. So, um, and possibly something else if we see it. <laughs> so uh, let's let's get to it. Um, also, I replaced the glass with mana glass, and I have to say, I think it looks much better. Uh, the blue tint makes it look like it's just ocean, <laughs> like you could just walk right into the ocean from there. Uh, so that's that looks pretty nice. I like it. Um, okay, and I checked the sea pickle levels. <laughs> sea pickles, and there's almost 9,000. <laughs> so we can definitely get these done, and this is pouring in. 31, 32. Um, I did, uh, I got rid of, let's go out there and look. I'll show you. I got rid of the sea pickle that I had planted out here and put the rubber seed back there because I'm gonna need more. I thought I had enough for my whole lifetime, uh, but um, I did, but except for singularity. So I need more for singularity, so I planted this guy. And when I broke the, uh, the botany pot, I got my bucket back. I got a bucket of water instead of the water just spilling out everywhere. It gets you the bucket back. So that's good to know. Um, so, uh, in here, oop, oh no, wrong one. In here, um, I planted like a full level of oak. That's 33. <laughs> so that's gotta help. Uh, and then I, I want to plant like um, birch or acacia over there. Just haven't done it. Uh, these are all empty, but they have they have farmland and they're ready to go. So I need to put something in there. I was just waiting till I figured out what I needed the most. But I planted sea pickles in here, and I had to get eleven buckets. So <laughs> it's good to know that. I get you get them back if you, if you break the water or you break the, the bottom pot so that's cool uh, so I got 11 sea pickles and they make a little slimy sound when they're broke <laughs> uh, so this is a pretty noisy place um, you would think it would be nice and peaceful with all the plants but they're always breaking there we go you see the sea pickles going down. I was worried that it would be too far up to see the chest because I know out on the barge I had to put in a couple extra cable uh, just because some of the stuff wasn't uh, coming out of the chest because it didn't see it. Uh, so Let's go get the sea pickle um, done before I get distracted. Oh yeah, that just so super fast now. And a boop. I take you out. So that's super. Um, I've been kind of messing around with the capacitato, I'm trying to figure out where it's stuck. Um, so I've been systematically going through taking out all the steps and just automating them, where they just automatically happen. They don't just happen when they need to happen, they happen no matter what. Uh, so. Um, start at 
the essence, I have the, what's my essence? I uh, have the essence going in here automatically getting turned into rubber, not just as it's needed, but it just turns it into rubber. And then I have the rubber going into here to get smelted into um, the black rubber. And as you can see, we have 2.9 thousand, which isn't technically enough for 1500 um, so I'm wondering if that's the holdup but it's only 16 short it's only 16 short uh, my last ditch effort is going to be uh, to just take it off of here and manually you do it myself. <laughs> like, what, what's the world coming to? Oh, and I made the 16K, this one right here, with one click. I was so happy uh, that I could make 16, well, not 16K, 16 meg storage disk without having to first craft the 3, 4, four meg storage disk. Uh, but Yes, I was very happy with my accomplishment. Probably can't do it again. Yeah, I'm missing a whole bunch of silicon. Uh, so the silicon is getting used by several things. So how, how much silicon do we have? I might have to use another stonework factory and have it make silicon as well. probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Um, what is this doing? It's making, it's using cobble and making gravel, which I could do with a material stonework factory without it consuming my cobble. It has its own cobble. <laughs> so I might do that. Look into doing that and possibly setting up because uh, then I wouldn't need this importer because it wouldn't need to take the gravel out and put the gravel in. Oh, I think it's in case I get the sand or flint. If I do a material stonework factory, I won't need to do that. Uh, so I can put another one there. So that's that's a plan. Let's go check out our sea pickle. Oh yeah, it's ready. Awesome. One more singularity out of the way. And uh, what do we got? Oak, crystal shard, phytogrow, clay, and silicon. Yeah, and I think the silicon would help with the singularity as well. Um, Sea pickle crusher. That's not bad. I have a. I could probably use it in the future, uh, but at the moment, uh, I might might try four times. Uh, or I didn't like the five times. It was very. I don't know, maybe I'm just not familiar enough with mechanism to make it smooth. <laughs> um, but let's go look at these potatoes again. Um, let's check our rubber. It's 2.9k. But if I only make 1436, which we have 64, which would make 1500. I don't need the full 30k or 3k. Uh, so let's do only craftables. Why? There's my craftables. So let's do 1400 and 
36. It looks like it has everything available to it. I wonder how can I get this into all right that started but it's probably not going to display oh fun it's done it's done just like that to take one out because it's gonna oh let's do this um, we'll come over here we'll take you out we'll come in here we'll take you out and we'll do oh so now I shouldn't be uh, charging it so the potato should stay the potato. <laughs> Yay! So now we can tell it to suck it in over here. Boom. Um, now this is going to take a while because uh, it's only one at a time. Okay, so mission successful <laughs> we we have started the capacitato there was this something about this um hopefully uh i wanted to keep 1500 on at all times so i didn't have to go in and go whoa i need this but the potato is quirky so it does not want to just make itself um Unfortunately. Uh, so before I forget, let's do this. Put you back in. Uh, we'll turn you back on. And put you back in. Um, also, between episodes, I was working on my Draconic Evolution. Uh, and I have I filled in all of the slots. Uh, I made a couple more large shield capacitors, capacity modules, and then I made four more uh, draconic shield recovery modules. This thing is, <laughs> I got 1800 shields now and it recharges pretty quickly. Uh, so that's kind of cool. How are we doing over here, Capacitato? Oh, it's going as fast as it can. The stack upgrade isn't helping this, so maybe if I... I think I have some extras in here. If I throw in three of these speed upgrades, uh, it'll help with the potatoes. Yeah, there it goes. You can almost see one. Okay, that well, that will help a little bit anyway. Um, what else can we do? Uh, I'm sure there's something in here. Oh, the neural processors. Those are going to be painful uh, because they take diamond. No? Yeah, they do. They take a diamond. Um, a raw advanced processor, an improved processor, processor binding, obsidian, and nether quartz. Ouch, that's 4,500 nether quartz. 3,000 obsidian. I don't know that my obsidian is uh, coming in enough to have 3,000. Where is my obsidian? Oh, I do have 3.2 thousand. That's nice. Because I have obsidian seeds going. I may need to get some more obsidian seeds if I'm going to be using that on um, on singularities. But we have a 
start that one yet. I'm not sure that I want to do that one. I haven't even checked my diamond levels. Diamond. Oh, that's 6,000 diamonds. Oh, we gotta make a singularity or something. Um, so premium coal singularity. Don't know that I have this premium. Uh, I'm thinking I may uh, take out the insanium from here and just have it go back to making the supremium. That way I don't have to add an extra step to downcraft the insane. But look at that, it's coming in pretty fast. Uh, but I did make a power pot for uh, it's, uh, Inferium. I wanted to say Insanium, but I was like, no, that's wrong. Um, plus, I have still the Inferium out on the barge. And I was thinking of putting, like, a partial row of Inferium in uh, the Botany Garden. <laughs> I need to label this one. Do I have a sign? Yes, I do have a sign. So I don't forget. This one um, as well. And I have another one that has, like, this one just has a little bit of uh, lava production in it. we got today so far. That's super awesome. I just wish I knew. Oh, it's on the top. You just can't see it in um, inside. I wonder if it goes away when it's finished. It's swirling up here. gone. Oh, we learned something new. Those look almost exactly like a basic crate and a capacitato. That may be a slightly different tan color. Slightly different. That's three, three similarities we got. Oh, so good. Another bedrock. Oops. 
and a Herculean Flux storage. Okay, this is the first time I've opened this. Okay, whoo. I'm very scared every time I do that. And I have uh, another bedrock. Oh, maybe that's maybe that got lost. 444 items. I still need to seriously consider making a little ME network over here for all that. That would be kind of cool. Uh, do the smallest network. So, what other similarities can we do? Any other? I'm tempted to start this guy because um, that would utilize um, the long, long chain of uh, oxygen liquid ethylene. Uh, ethylene is liquid ethylene is made from ethylene, and ethylene is made from hydrogen and water. That's 100 millibuckets with biofuel, and it turns it into a substrate and ethylene. In the pressurized reaction chamber, and then uh, the hydrogen is just. got from uh, separating water into hydrogen and oxygen. Oh, sawdust we're not ready for. We still wait for that. I may have to, uh, it's got 425, I may have to, especially since it may, um, basic crates already. I'm not going to be getting, uh, well I am going to get it because it's going to start making more sawdust um, or strip logs. Let's look at the crates. Yeah, it's got 300 already. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's just not enough. For the sawdust, I think we may just have to uh, get get another get another sawmill. But instead of doing oak, we could do I think so sawdust. It's produced in the sawmill, but this is only a 25% chance when you strip up. When you uh, put a log in there. Oh, I think if you put it through the, if you put wood through the pulverizer, you will get more sawdust. Ah, so it'll take any log and you get eight sawdust. But I needed all those stripped logs anyway. Um, so that's good. Um, we, can, we can already, we already have a pulverizer set up. Uh, so maybe we not not have to do anything. It may be full. The, the crafter may be full. Oh, okay. So we're in luck. This one has a few slots open. Uh, and this one does too. So we can have it either uh, craft it on demand or do it automatically. I think if I teach it, that one's not really producing um, 
sawdust, it's producing stripped oak logs as and as a byproduct is getting sawdust. So it has nothing to do with sawdust over here. Um, uh, just it's looking for oak logs. If oak is over 2,000, then it strips it, leaving enough in there for us uh, to do an oak singularity and producing some sawdust while it's at it. Um, so I'm wondering if I need to just do a separate pulverizer. That way I can I can control it, put a detector on it, and tell it to only do it if it's necessary. Because like if we already have enough sawdust, uh, then we don't need it. So yeah, maybe we might want to do. Do I have a, an extra pulverizer in the system? I do. I do. Do I have a detector? I don't. Awesome. Um, an X. I think I might have an exporter. There we go, we have all the bits that we need. Um, I think I want to put it right next to this since they're so closely related. That way I know. We want the importer on the back. Exporter on the top and the detector. So the detector wants to look at the sawdust. The block of sawdust. Um, and it wants to say if there's Less than 1500, then do this. Get signal when under the amount. Okay, so that's going to turn this on. Um, oh, do I do wood? Do I do oak wood? Let's look at some of the other. How much do we got? So we got 4.5k dark oak. Look, we're down to 983 oak logs. We have 6.1k spruce. So that's cool. I think I'll use the spruce um, as this. We'll set the spruce in. We want it to only work with the redstone signal. And uh, then we need to set this up in through the top, out through the back. Oh, this is going to produce so much sawdust. <laughs> Look at it. Um, so I need to speed that up, I guess, since it produces eight. Um, I only have the three. I don't have a stack upgrade. Let's see if the three will clear it up. But um, this isn't, it's going pretty fast. Uh, don't even have an upgrade in there. Do I have one in my system? Component? No, I have four hardened ones. Uh, put a block of sawdust away. I don't know that I have any signaling gears. Ooh. Maybe I 
you have aluminum here. Oh, sweet. Nice. Okay. So we put that in there. Oh, look how fast it goes. <laughs> um, we may need that stack of earth grade after all. <laughs> um. Oh, I do have a stack upgrade. Excellent, excellent. Let's put you up there. Now are you clearing up? Oh yeah, that's super duper good. I think that's fast enough. I don't think we need any speed upgrades in there. It's going pretty darn fast. Um, let's see. Where is my um, guy making the sawdust? Is it over here? Yes, it's right there. Now let's look at the sawdust. Oh, it's not. Just bumped up, made a whole bunch all at once. 576. That's crazy fast. Look at that go. Uh, so that will work until it gets to 1500, and then it'll stop. Uh, It's super fast. It's super, 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 super fast. Uh, but the other system will still produce some when we need the logs, so that's cool. Um, oh, I'm, I want to get some of the more difficult ones started. Uh, understand this one. The Dense construction block. It says building gadgets, uh, but there is no recipe. So I have no idea. Uh, Mike, if you look at building gadgets, You can see that there's dense construction block, construction block, and construction block powder, dense construction chunks, and construction paste, but there's no recipe for these either. Place next to water. This gets construction block powder. Wow, this so zoomy. I don't know. Let's let's try it. Um, sand. Um, clay. Construction block powder. We got a stack of that, but is this gonna make. What's it gonna make? I don't know. <laughs> Probably just a regular construction block. Let's take this guy up. Oh, it just turned a dense construction block. Okay. Ah, uh, no. Am I supposed to get it with, um... It looked 
like it turned. Dense construction block. Maybe I need like silk touch. Just keeps turning into construction paste. Let's try our silk touch guy here. Oh, 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 oh. So it takes it a second. We found things out. Dense construction block. Oh, 1,500 of those. There's got to be a way to automate that. Um, with like a block placer and um, stuff. Uh, I know this is a mechanical placer, so we can probably get that. We can probably teach this to the system pretty, pretty easily. Well, now we know how to do dense construction blocks. All right, let's um, put you back down because we probably want to uh, put, yeah, let's make a mechanical placer. So what can I do with this construction paste? Is my silk touch going to wear out? How do I harvest with silk touch? Ah, oh, dispenser. Oh, I can't put in there or it will eat it. There we go. Mechanical placer. That's half problem. Uh, we also need to teach it construction block powder. First things first. <laughs> we need to automate it. Um, Awesome. Um, well, I don't really know what, um, where I want to put this, so I think I'm going to go ahead and call the episode here and try to figure out where I want to put this and how I can set it up uh, to get us this dense construction block. Um, yeah, so... leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Uh, and thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!